Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today we will start our 7th lecture of course calculus 2. In today's lecture we will study chain rule for partial derivatives. So first of all we will draw the chain rule and we will see that how we can draw it. Basically we have one variable that is z. We will we can take the two derivatives that are partial of z by partial of x and same partial of z by partial of y. Now for partial of z by partial of x we are reaching at x and y. For x we can take the partial of, of z with respect to x and with y we can take the partial of z with partial of y. Now for the x we will reach the another two variables if we have u if we have v. So we will write it as we can take the derivative of x with respect to u partial of x by partial of u and same for v partial of x by partial of v. Now with y we will have the two variables u and v. With u we can take the partial of y by partial of u and with v we can take the partial of y by partial of v. This is basically the chain rule. While reaching to the x we can take the derivative of z with respect to x, we can take the derivative of z with respect to y and so on. So to find the partial of z by partial of u. Now we have to write it by our chain rule. That to reach partial of z by partial of u, we have to take first the partial of z by partial of x. Which means we can take the partial of x with respect to partial of u. Plus we can also take the partial of z by partial of y plus we are taking the with respect to u so we are taking Sorry. So we have to take the partial of y with respect to partial of u. We are writing it. It will be more easy for you that if you will see that partial of x can be simplified and we are left with partial of z by partial of u, this value. If partial of y will be simplified, we will be left with partial of z by partial of u, this value again. So this is how you write it. Now for partial of z by partial of v, we have to take the partial of z with respect to partial of partial of z with v. We have to write first of all partial of z by partial of x, then partial of x by partial of v. Plus partial of z, we have to take the partial of z by v. So this line, on this line we have partial of z by partial of y and partial of y by partial of v. This is how we solve the chain rule. Now we will do one example so we can understand that how we can solve it. Sometimes while solving our question we will not always draw our chain rule but we can write it exactly our equations. And you should know that how we can write it. Partial of z by partial of u, you have to do the partial of z by partial of u and you have to write the other terms as that they can be simplified. So your equation will be satisfied. So now we will write it for a question. The questions of the chain rule are little bit lengthy but to solve them is easy. So w is equal to e raised to power x y w is equal to e x y z x is equal to 3u plus v where y is equal to 3u minus v and z is equal to u square v. And we have to find out partial of w with partial of u. 
we have to find out the derivative of w with respect to u and we have to find out the derivative of w with respect to v so according to our main equation our this one equation will be partial of w by partial of x partial of x by what we are finding partial of u plus partial of w we have to write with y also partial of y partial of y by partial of u partial of w by partial of u is equal to we have to find out the partial by partial of x of our w which is e raised to power x y z and then partial of x with respect to u we have to put our value of x that is 3u plus v then plus partial of w with respect to y that is e raised to power x y z plus partial by partial of u with y the value of y is 3u minus v partial of w by partial of u is equal to when we will take the derivative of our this value our answer will be y z e raised to power x y z i have told you already that how we take the derivative of exponential you can watch the previous video if i will start solving it here step by step it will be very lengthy so you should know that how we are solving it and you can watch my videos on it in our last lecture in implicit differentiation and in the partial and in the partial derivative with two variables i have solved it in detail so partial of x by partial of u for this our answer will be 3 plus partial of w by partial of y our answer will be x z e raised to power x y z and for partial of y by partial of u our answer will be 3 so partial of w by partial of u is equal to so our answer is 3 y z e raised to power x y z plus 3 x z e raised to power x y z we will take the exponential common e raised to power x y z into 3 y z plus 3 x z we can also take the 3 common so our equation will be like this we have to put our values of x y z 3 e raised to power 3 u plus v the value of y 3u minus v and the value of z is u square v and our values are y z that is 3u minus v into z that is u square v plus value of the x that is 3u plus v into the value of z that is u square v So three e raised to power. Our this value will be when you will solve it nine u square minus v square a square minus b square formula, or you can write it three u whole square also into u square v. Then you have nine. U cube v minus three u square v square minus three u cube v minus u square v square, and then the final answer that is three e raised to power nine u four v minus u square v cube six u cube v. Minus four u square 
be square so basically this will be our final answer now on the same method we will solve the partial of w by partial of v for this our formula will be partial of w by partial of v sorry partial of x partial of x by partial of partial of v plus partial of w by partial of y and then partial of y by we are taking with b so partial of v this will be our v equation now for partial of w by partial of x we will take the partial by partial of x and our value e x y z it will be partial of w by partial of x will give us y z e raised to power x y z partial of x by partial of v is equal to our x value that is 3u plus v and it will give us partial of x by partial of v is equal to 1 partial of w by partial of y is equal to x z e raised to power x y z and partial of y by partial of v will be equal to minus 1. These will be the derivatives you will get and your final answer will be e raised to power 9u4 v minus u square v cube into 2u square v square. This will be your final answer. You have to put these values and you have to solve it by yourself. I have solved the derivative of w with respect to u and you have to find it out the partial of w by partial of v by yourself. But if you have any kind of question or confusion while solving it, you will ask in the comment section. It is very easy. I have told you the values. You just have to put these values and solve the question. And how will you get these values? You have to see the lecture which is partial derivative of two variables. In that I told you that how we solve the simple partial derivatives. How we solve the derivative of exponential. So just watch that video and then solve it by yourself. And I hope you will get this answer. But if not then you may ask me.